my first music inspiration were Michael Jackson. So my first, very first album was uh, Bad. And um, as soon uh, as I saw him performing, like dancing, singing, I knew that I wanted to do this later. And um, that's my very, very first inspiration and why I wanted to, to do and live by the music. And you? My first inspiration would be Michael Jackson. And the album that inspired me would be Off the Wall. So the first album. Um, I s still, when I hear the songs, like Don't Stop Till You Get Enough or I Want to Rock With You, something happens in my body. I felt a huge inspiration. I loved all the videos. I remember when I still remember the time for the first time and I knew I want I wanted to collab, dance, singing and acting in one. And all these passions are in me. And I'm still inspired by Michael Jackson when I look back at what he did. And I always dreamt to see him live, but it never happened. But I have a lot of DVDs, so <laughs> I'm trying to relieve that with Dolby Surround. The biggest challenge for an artist is to have the longest career possible. It's, like, mm -hmm. it's not only on five, two years. The, the the biggest challenge for an artist is to still be here like 40 years after like did for example Michael Jackson and artists like that Prince and uh, and all the biggest artists they have long career so um, you can't pretend to be a, a, a big star a superstar in the music industry if you're not like uh, 20 years in the in the music industry I think the biggest challenge for me is to feel fulfilled as an artist. I think that's the most important for me. To one day sit back in my armchair and say, yes, I wanted to do this, this and that, and I've succeeded. I showed my emotions and all my artistry, and there are people there that I helped through music or I inspired by music. I think that's my biggest challenge and that's my biggest dream. <laughs> <laughs> we're gonna buy a house together yeah um, we're gonna go on holidays together mm -hmm. yeah um we thought of having a dog right yeah the mm. dog um a white dog white brown brown yeah brown dog mm. <laughs> <laughs> Well, Matt promised to teach me some more French. Yeah, and you promised me to teach me some more Polish. Yeah, <laughs> but <laughs> really, like seriously speaking, um, definitely Matt is going to come to Poland mm -hmm. uh, to shoot the video. So um, all the fans of Matt in Poland, you are welcome to come to the set and see Matt live version. <laughs> uh, we're going to record the video and then definitely we're going to do some performances together. I want Matt to uh, perform on my shows and also on a huge show called So You Think You Can Dance. I'm here. <laughs> Agree. You want to feel me now The way that we get down I'm a really, really, really bad German. I'm a really, really bad German. Wanna see how we how we get down. Wanna see how we how we get get. Wanna see how we how we get down. Wanna see how we how we get get. Wanna see how we how we get down. Wanna see how we how we get get. Wanna see how we how we get down. Wanna see how we how we get. That, yeah, that, that's great. Thank you, everybody. 
Tak właśnie dobiegł do końca dzień trzeci naszej podróży do Paryża. Czas wracać do domu. Już nie mogę doczekać się, aż pokażę Wam efekty mojej współpracy z Matem Pokorą. Mam nadzieję, że singiel Wam się spodoba, a już niedługo pracę nad teledyskiem, także nie mogę się doczekać. Całuję Was mocno i do usłyszenia, zobaczenia.